New figures show more WA men are dying from melanoma than ever before. The Cancer Council says despite a drop in the number of people being diagnosed, more of us are skipping early detection. It's a title West Australians aren't proud of. We're world champions when it comes to skin cancer. Just behind Queensland, WA has the worst skin cancer rates. In 2011, there were more than 1,000 new cases. 180 people died. Three quarters of those deaths were men. Clinton Hill was diagnosed with melanoma when he was just 22. Eight years later, he's still fighting off recurring tumours. Men are probably un unlikely to, to go to the doctor with a little spot on their skin. We need to get our act together, report these things earlier. It's not just skin cancer West Australians are being warned about. 2011 saw more than 3,800 cancer deaths. Prostate cancer among the highest, rising by 10%. In an effort to relieve pressure on WA's cancer services, the state government will boost staff levels at PMH, spending almost $4 million a year. And adult cancer services have been given a $20 million injection, providing extra hands, including radiation oncologists at Sir Charles Gardner Hospital and a bone marrow transplant surgeon here at RPH. But the Cancer Council says they could always do with more. So what's also important is to actually make sure you have administrative staff as well so that you're not having your clinicians doing administrative work. Tracy Vaux, Nine News.